Oh, day uh, four, isn't it, Chad? Something like that. I'm losing count. <laughs> Don't ask me. I use the wrong start points. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I thought it was about time for a shave. I've gone for a week. It's still me about my limits. So, um, yeah, another week's time. Ready for another shave, I guess. But uh, I, think, I think it'll I'll be due soon. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, what's happening today? Let's, uh, let's have a quick look out here. We've got thunderstorms. We've got thunderstorms. Got thunderstorms. Cues. Building thunderstorms. Thunderstorms. Some more thunderstorms. And over there are some more thunderstorms. So basically today uh, we're heading out to the southwest, yep. into the north, back via Death Valley, and uh, home again. Yes, the plan is uh, cut Death Valley very short, of course, and uh, stay away from Pilliga, run the storm lines, and uh, get home after two hours, uh, which is the AAT. So, I like two hours better than two and a half. It's a bit more realistic for us, our small wings aircraft. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. So, um, yeah, anyway, that's uh, hopefully the day pans out well and we're flying VE most of it. We'll get back to you sometime soon. See ya. Oh, pre start. And uh, guess what? You can probably see it behind me, but there's uh, finally got some uh, some cues. And uh, you can probably hear in the background as well, so, uh, very hey. So, so far, I'm a happy boy. I uh, only climbing a couple of knots now, but it's only pre start, so it's no big deal. Just working out towards my uh, start point at the moment, uh, which is another uh, 5k away. I was last launch today, so I've got a bit of catching up to do. Try and get away Club pretty Club quick, smart. And uh, yeah, we'll go racing and try and beat these storms home. We'll uh, chat to you en route. See ya. Well, we're on, uh, we're on track now, climbing at uh, was uh, six knots. It's uh, just started off now at four and a half. And uh, yeah, basically uh, there's been lots of uh, people bleating on the radio about uh, poor conditions. So I'm going to take this one uh, to the top, head out to my turn point, probably uh, run uh, home pretty shortly I reckon. Uh, storms are building everywhere and uh, the guys don't seem too happy up north. So uh, I think it might be a day just to, to finish early or finish instead. So um, anyway, I'm going to get back to it and uh, we'll talk to you shortly hopefully. Uh, we've, just, we've just had another comedy moment. Now the uh, glider's pressed to talk switch is buggered. <laughs> so now I can't talk on the radio anyway. Maybe they try to tell me something I talk on the radio too much. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm back to 65 knots after that last climb that I spoke to in. Uh, yeah, taking everyone's, uh, everyone's bleating on the radio uh, seriously. So I think I might just nick the, uh, nick the climb and try and get back into the buoyant area as soon as possible. Might go home a different way as well. Uh, there's a uh, bit of a trough line over there on our left. Uh, maybe it might be worth going over there, uh, running that back home into the circle, and then uh, coming home and cover an extra 40k. But it's probably going to be better than a paddock, of course. So anyway, we'll get back to it and we'll see how we go. Oh, this is nice. Uh, we're just cruising along now. Been at uh, 60 knots uh, for quite some time without a bump. That's uh, what we're flying into at the moment, so um, hope we get a climb off the ridges in front of me and uh, we'll go from there. Better get back to it. Well, uh, I'm climbing in five knots now. Woohoo! Can't believe it. I got away from about a thousand feet, I reckon. And uh, this was the first cloud of the, um, yeah, since, uh, yeah, since busting that big blue hole. Uh, start off at two knots, uh, it's now building in 5.4. Woohoo! So cloud base another three or four thousand feet above me. This one will be going all the way to the top. And uh, then we'll be just uh, playing the rest as it comes. Uh, storms don't seem to be too much of a threat at the moment. So I'm um, going to have to run uh, the little bit uh, yeah, further forward north than I thought. And then uh, we'll run home, kiss the Death Valley, and then, um, then uh, we'll be uh, yeah, running home. Hopefully uh, just over time and uh, with a good result. So far I'm feeling okay, we're doing uh, 87 kilometers per hour to this point, so not too shabby I think, considering. Anyway, I better get back to it. Uh, woo -hoo! I'll talk to you again soon. We've finally got a climb that's uh, taken me by the uh, Gilhulus. Five knots, which is uh, quite nice. Uh, I've been only been able to get three knots here and there, so taking them each uh, 500 foot by 500 foot. And uh, yeah, so finally climbing. Hopefully going to get high off this one and, and finish the task pretty soon. Anyway, I'm going to get back to it because I'm pretty keen to get up, so uh, I'll talk to you all soon. Well, I've finally uh, been uh, back at high base, climbed up in the last climb at uh, 
uh, just five knots and uh, cruising along for home now uh, saying we're going through that tunnel so I'll, I'll extend this uh, sector a little bit more get hopefully a couple of big climbs underneath a few big cells and then uh, yeah race home so uh, yeah not doing that fast anymore but it doesn't matter uh, having, having a good time all the same we'll uh, get back to you whenever I get back to you see ya so we're just about to enter the uh, storm area uh, my wind pilot's saying it'll be uh, plus one minute at the moment which is nice and uh, yeah so I'm just going to run this here uh, yeah basically up straight where I'm going and uh, we'll turn for home and should be uh, well hopefully 90 kilometers, 92 kilometers per hour when I land. Anyway I'm going to get uh, back to it and uh, we'll talk to you sometime soon. There we are climbing on the front of the uh, storm front you can see uh, just here now it's on my wingtip so I might uh, actually just extend my distance a bit more while it's going up and uh, hopefully improve my speed so Fingers crossed, but this uh, freight train ride could be quite cool. We'll uh, see how we go, and uh, yeah, woohoo! Yeah. I don't know who that is, but uh, anyway, we've got a good comfortable Mars, well, a good comfortable glide now. Uh, just three minutes over, cruising at uh, 95 knots now. It's going to keep uh, keep running this, uh, obviously, this storm line, and uh, we'll be home before we know it. Unfortunately, I didn't use the distance too well, but you know, that's uh, another thing you learn, eh? Anyway, I'm going to get back to this uh, bumpy farmer glide, and we'll see you on the ground. Here we are, back at the keep it just headed in my trace. Uh, around the storm front as you saw, had a great little time. The uh, end up doing 95 kilometers per hour. Probably not gonna be fast enough to win, but uh, anyway, still had fun, which is all that matters. And uh, a lot of people are back, survived the big one. 